Hi guys, it's Erin. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to share with you some new items in my Etsy shop. They include cash envelope kits, cash envelope sets, and cash envelope dividers. So just stay tuned and I'll explain the difference of all of those to you. All right, so here is the poly bag that I will be mailing the sets in from now on. And this is just really plain. It will have your mailing information on it, of course. And inside, all of the kits, sets, dividers, everything that you purchase will come in an envelope, just like this. It's got this gold pineapple foiling inside. So this is actually considered a kit. And what makes this a kit is it has three components to it. It has the cash registers. So those are important for a lot of people. They like to keep track of how much they're spending um, daily, weekly, whatever it may be. The cash envelopes and then the materials to make your belly bands. So if you're not familiar with what I consider a belly band, this is a belly band. And for my sinking funds, I always use like a piece of paper like this. I fold it in thirds and I make a band out of it. And that holds my sinking funds. I don't have envelopes for my sinking funds personally. I just use a band system. So if you're not into sinking funds or you're not into bands, you can literally use this as um, list making paper or do whatever you want with it. It's just plain on the other side. And if you don't have enough cash envelopes, you can just band some of your cash and write inside um, what the uh, category is and put a label on it, whatever you want to do. So this is my first savings kit that I want to share with you. And of course, anything holiday is limited edition. And I want to come out with this as a Christmas in July um, type theme. So this is called the Candy Colored Holiday Savings Kit. And I will show you the patterns and the rest of these I'm going to go through really quickly because in an interest to save time and show you everything, I don't want to spend um, too much on any one set. So again, if you're confused as to what's considered a kit, what's considered a set, what the dividers are like, just go ahead and check out my Etsy shop and all the details for every listing will be there. So this one is what I'm calling a mini kit on Etsy. And the reason why I did this it does come with the three components, but there's only two envelopes and two papers to this. The reason why I did this is because some people don't need a full set of holiday envelopes. And this um, weekend, I will also be listing some single envelopes. So in case you just want to have, you know, maybe one envelope added to your collection that you're going to be putting all your holiday cash in, that was the purpose for that. So let me continue with the kits that have all the components. This one is called... Um, Merlot Country. And again, I'm not going to show you all the pieces inside. You guys get the gist. Um, the pieces of paper match the envelopes. So this is Merlot Country. And guys, I have so much fun thinking of names for these. And some of the names are literally ridiculous, but it is still fun. It just adds, you know, kind of like a, you know, kind of just like a fun component to it. So that one's called Merlot Country. This one is called Mandala. This one looks kind of similar, but it does have some different papers to it. So this one, I love the marble. And the um, paper set that this came from, a lot of these papers um, is called Marrakesh. And I get my papers all over the place. You know, of course I get them in um, your usual suspect places, Michael's, Joanne's, Hobby Lobby, things like that. But I'm always on the lookout for different scrap papers. And I've been that way forever. This set is called Blueberry Wine. And it's got really rich blues in it. Um, not quite navy. More of a midnight collection, midnight blue. So that is a kit. And again, if you're interested in any of these at all and you want to visit them on Etsy, my Etsy shop is listed below. It's actually linked below. And thank you um, to Johanna for telling me <laughs> I needed to do that. Um, I didn't do that. This one's called Summer Whimsy. This is a kit. Um, but like I said, if you're interested on seeing what components come with which, um, every single listing will have those specifics for you. And please don't pay attention to my nails. They are horrible. I just painted them and... I really need to clean them up. So that's called Summer Whimsy. 
and I love that. You can't probably tell, but a lot of those, um, like the bicycles and the clouds were actually glittery. So I love that. And then I think this is my last full kit. And I do have multiples of some of these. And this one is called Gold Pieces. Love gold, who love shiny things. And I just think this is so awesome. I love this. So every single one of those has gold foiling to it. The papers as well. So that kit um, comes with all the gold foil I could muster up. Um, and I just, I absolutely love it. So that's called Gold Pieces and I do have um, multiples of that. So now we're going into cash envelopes only. The registers are definitely coming. This one is called Art Deco and I love this so much. I stayed in a hotel in New York City once. Um, my family did and it was decorated just like this. In fact, this was probably the most, um, I don't know, the most obvious Art Deco pattern to this set, but oh my gosh, I loved it. It was so beautiful. So that one is called Art Deco, and that is an envelope only. Now, when I say envelope only, those are sets, and they do come with the registers. So again, if you're curious what's what, all the Etsy listings will be very specific. This is called Polka Polka, and as you can see, there's lots of dot elements, except <laughs> some stripes. So that one is called Polka Polka. And like I said, all my sets come with the registers. They just don't come with the extra belly band papers. So that one is that. And I'm not really gonna have a chance to list or do videos for everything. So I just want to let you know there's gonna be new stuff on there that I probably don't get around to sharing on YouTube. This one is called Pineapple Cake. And this is a set. Now I do have this in kit form as well. So if you're interested in all the components, um, that will be on there too. So I absolutely love that one. I think it's so summery. So that one is pineapple cake. This one is pillow clouds. And it's very similar to the um, bridal set that I have coming, but there is more color to this one. So this one's called Pillow Clouds. Really soft, pretty colors. Um, somewhat neutral, you know. And I do know that I need to add some more color into my um, collections because a lot of mine are pretty neutral. This one is called Wedding Dreams Savings. And you can see the reason for this is that it is all pearlescent papers. And I know that the camera's not picking that up and because they're laminated, it might be covered just a bit, but they all do have a kind of pearlized texture to them. They're so pretty. So that one is Wedding Dreams Savings. And this one is called Christmas Treats. And this is, like I said, a set, not a kit, like the first one. And you can see there's like these little hot cocoa treats and it's just super cute. This reminds me of like an old fashioned Christmas sweater. So I think this one is like super, super adorable. So that's that. Now let's get into some dividers before I wrap this up. I'll show you really quickly. This is my Art Deco again, but this is in a divider set. So dividers come with six, just like the envelopes, and they are less expensive because they do take less um, paper, less material, um, and they do all have the same laminated over um, uh, label to it. So you can put these in your wallet and you can organize your cash that way. There are some people who prefer the dividers to the cash envelopes themselves. And I have a polka polka set like that. And um, so that's why I am now making the dividers too. And I really like them. Now you can, of course, write on the entire back of these with your Sharpie, your dry erase, or your wet erase marker. Um, and if you're using a Sharpie, um, the word is, everybody says that it's very easy to remove if you have acetone polish remover or alcohol. This one is called Steely Glam, and I love this. I absolutely am in love with it. So let's pull this off. 
it has just like these deep rich grayish taupe colors to it it is beautiful and this one has a nice bit of foiling added so this one is called steely glam for those of you who recognize it's not a pun but you guys know steely dan and i just thought the color was the name for the color was totally perfect so i do have i believe a couple sets of those this one i'm just calling sophistication now we have um, quite a few rooms in our house painted with a paint color called sophistication and it is a pre-mixed color from i can't remember the brand but it's from walmart it's gorgeous and some of these like this one the lighter one reminds me of that so this is your sophistication dividers love those and this one is called gray suede dreams it's like sophistication but it is not exactly the same and so you have a lot more of your steel gray component to that but again i gave you one with um, some foiling and i also guys i want to let you know i have a cash envelope um wallet to review for you so i'll be doing that this weekend as well um, I have my pineapple cake dividers. So this is just like the pineapple cake envelope set. So I'm not even going to take that out. And then this one is the Here Comes the Bride dividers. So there may be a couple other things um, following this video that are on the Etsy shop that I'm not showing here. And I'm going to continue to list tonight. But I just wanted to share those with you because those were the bulk of um, what I worked on this weekend. So thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Thank you so much for anybody who has already purchased a kit or supported my Etsy. Um, my envelopes are super basic. I say that all the time. They are not um, very fancy. There's no bells and whistles to them, um, but they do do the trick and I personally use them. I made myself a new set. I can't wait. And um, that's it, guys. So thank you so much for watching and spending some time with me. Hope you guys are having an awesome weekend. It is raining here again, and this makes like the 40th day in a row. Um, but anyway, um, the weekend is still going good. So thanks again, and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Take care.